according to the theoretical calculations we have calculated that this boat is going to run for at least four and a half hours uh, where other teams last year other teams like the maximum duration of the boats were three hours and approximately two to three hours so uh, we expect this time the our boat is going to be uh, the most endured boat like for the during the endurance race uh, the maximum time is going to be four to four and a half hours theoretically uh, the last week our boat was tested in in our premises like in the Coimbatore itself so uh, we managed to get around four to five hours as the endurance time which is a which was a successful result for us and the total cost of making the boat was uh, around 15 to 18 lakhs. Yeah. What is the efficiency of this boat in fact? Like, it should be very heavy or it should be very light or in fact light. It, it, the boat what must be... It's going to have an impact in the... The boat must be, it must be very efficient because since it's a racing competition, the boats are made uh, lightest possible because uh, uh, the more heavier the boat, the, it affects the, it uh, linearly affects the speed of the boat actually. Since it's a racing competition, the boat must be lighter and for that, purpose we have included uh, carbon fiber monocoque structure which is going to uh, make the boat more lighter and even two to three person can lift the boat completely. So how many of you have designed this? And, uh... We comprise of 10 engineering undergraduate students. Yeah. Uh, each of them are from different uh, departments so it, uh, it is an interdisciplinary team. Like the, there are different domains in the team where uh, the mechanical, electrical, mechatronics and instrumentation students are also involved in the team. Yeah. When, when is the event is going to take place? Uh, the, the event is going to take place in July 1st week, that is from July 3rd to July 8th. Yeah.